Good morning Nerf fans, Sharky here. Um, this is just a quick update video, it's not what we had planned to put up today, it wasn't what we had planned to shoot on Friday. Um, basically on Friday the uh, plan was for me to head over to Kells and to the Nerf Cave um, and we planned on doing three videos. Um, part one and two of a drug double strike performance mods, part one being based on spring spaces, part two uh, being things like white lithium grease, uh, dead space removal and things of that nature. Um, and it, each stage we had planned on using a chronograph to do FPS readings so that we could actually quantify what improvement um, each part of it made. Um, so part one was about the spring spaces. Um, we had three double strikes. Um, I had two and Kel had uh, one. Um, so what we would plan to do was to do one standard, one with a four mil spacer in it, one with an eight mil spacer in it. What we got was some very weird results. So we looked at that and we went, okay, maybe an eight mil is too much. Uh, maybe we should do a six mil. So we then retested with a six mil. We still got weird results, but as we were doing that and taking, and we'd got all three of these open at the point in time, and as you can see, they've just got the cosmetic front ends, which is something that Fendel and Nerf Works make. Um, and uh, to fit these onto one of these, you need to file off the front barrel, top and bottom, as you can see in direct comparison there, to fit that on as a friction fit. You can glue in place, obviously, um, that's totally down to the individual. But yes, um, so what we found was, internally, all three of these are different, um, which was a bit weird. Um, so we then, we were running short on time, so we then did retesting using this one um, on standard four mil, six mil, and eight mil. Um, and that's all we had time for on Friday. Um, so Saturday, um, I sat down and crunched the numbers, did, did, the, did the maths, and realized that to be fair, we needed to do a full testing of all three uh, spring spaces on all three um, ones to see which, if any, suited each of these three styles. Because at the end of the day, um, Fenland Nerfworks don't want to sell a product that's actually not any use to anybody and if it proves that it's not going to do anything then why sell it? Um, so that's part of the integrity that Kel um, kind of and, and I talked over that that's important. So um, as it stands uh, we've got some data uh, we need to complete the data set um, which won't happen until next Friday um, when that's done, uh, the numbers will get crunched and then you can look to see an update video which will have all of the data in it on all three pistols uh, with all three or all four uh, things. The idea being that initially that the four and six mil will be available uh, primarily for use with um, the zombie, uh, zombie sh uh, strike uh, or double strike. Um, and the 8 mil and there's a 12 mil will be available for hammer shots. So obviously we, the, the, the plan is also to do uh, similar testing with hammer shots uh, to see the um, FPS increase uh, from just putting the spring spacer in. Because as I say, part, part of it in the integrity of Fenn and Nerfworks is what's the point of making a product and selling a product if it's not actually going to improve things? and um, a spring spacer is one of the common mods that's been done throughout uh, the Nerf modding uh, fraternity um, but you know I don't think anybody has actually done a, a test of standard and then with different um, integrity so that's what we're trying to do um, that's what's coming up um, and hopefully this will be of interest to you um, so this will be part one part two will be um, just on the spring spaces. 
hopefully that should be available next weekend. Um, and then once we've got that, we will then look at doing, and it'll probably be on this one, um, we're gonna do white lithium grease, uh, white lithium grease and dead space removal in the plunger head, and then uh, white lithium grease, dead space removal in the plunger head, and dead space removal uh, in and around uh, the air restrictor. Um, we'll show all of that, um, and the plan is to, to do that as the, the final part on, on the double strokes. So anyway, that's all for now. Um, have a great time and look forward to catching you soon. Cheers.